So, J.P. Greenwood, congratulations on attending uh, Art San Diego 2016. Each year, uh, the committee will review the exhibitors and award the director's award for the show. And this year, they've chosen you and your gallery, your exhibition, for the director's award for 2016. So I want to give you the award and congratulate you. Thank you very much. All right. I appreciate that. So, JP, why don't you give us a little background on uh, you as an artist, you as a gallery owner. Uh, give us an understanding of the inspiration of the work, how it began, uh, who you are as an artist. I, I actually started off as a uh, commercial photographer. Uh, I went to school for photography. I went to Art Center in Pasadena. And I did commercial photography for about 15 years, uh, photographing people completely different from this. I got to do all the things that I, that I wanted to do, but unfortunately, the industry started to change quite a bit. Things started slowing down. I started to rethink whether this is the right industry to still be in. All the while, as I was, as I was uh, thinking about these things, I had been taking pictures while on shoots for these commercial jobs. And I had decided I wanted to redecorate my house. I didn't know with what. I built a whole bunch of big frames. I hung them on my walls, empty, and trying to decide where I was gonna put them. And I decided, you know what, I'm actually a photographer. Maybe I should put some of my own stuff in here. People started coming around and enjoying what I had. I started selling a few things. Uh, next thing you know, it seemed to all fall into place. And uh, I started doing more shows. Slowly realized that maybe that was kind of where I should have been in the first place. So uh, it all kind of happened naturally from there. And, and the gallery is located where? Uh, San Clemente. In San Clemente. And has it always been I, in San Clemente? It's, yeah, yes. And I don't have an actual gallery. It's a home studio. Uh -huh. So what you I do... You invite collectors in. Exactly. Uh -huh. So and what inspired... I, I'm curious. I mean, obviously, as we take a look at some of the work that's here, uh, it's obvious to see that the ocean and uh, where you live inspires the work that you create. But there's also some kind of edgy, cool, like nice. the 619 thing and all that. Uh, give us an idea of where that creativity comes from. You know, uh, I've, also, I've always been interested in typography. Uh, back in school, I liked package design, I liked photography, I liked all kinds of just graphic uh, images. So when I used to do the commercial photography with people, I almost treated the people as if they were an object in the center of the frame. Everything was always very structured and clean. And so I carry that with all of this, you know, that I have portraits of objects. And so I do the same with this type of thing. It's very structured, straightforward, right down the center, clean graphic lines, and the typography comes into play. It's not every day that you mix these two things, but it's something that I enjoy doing and I decided that it doesn't always have to be as focused as I was taught. Well, that's great. Well, congratulations. Uh, glad you're here in San Diego and congratulations on your award. Thank you, I appreciate it. Thank All you right. very much.